morning, I'm Mrs. Francis, and today I'm here to help you with your math anchor. Yes, that Mrs. Francis of the English department to help you with your math anchor. Today we're going to be finding the slope of a line when given two points on that line. Let's try find the slope of the line passing through the points 1, negative 2, and 7, 6. The formula calls for you to subtract the y values over the x values. After you determine your formula, you want to label your points. x1 and y1, x2 and y2. And then you can plug them into your formula. 6 minus negative 2 over 7 minus 1. When subtracting a negative, it becomes a positive. So we have 8 over 6. We can reduce it, divide by 2, and our answer becomes 4 over 3. 4 over 3 is correct. Now, if you're going to be graphing this, there are a couple things you might want to keep in mind. When it's an improper fraction, do not make it into a mixed number. You can reduce it, but don't change it into a mixed number because it will be difficult to place on the axis. Also, always remember, rise over run. Your rise is over your run. So your y value is over your x value. Now try the problem you have in front of you. Okay, now let's see how you did. I'm going to put the formula up here because as an English teacher, I would want to make sure I know exactly what I'm doing. Labeled my components x1 and y1, x2 and y2, and then I would plug them in. So it would be 4 minus 12 over 5 minus 3, which then becomes negative 8 over 2. Can we reduce this? Yes. How about negative 4 over 1? Yeah. Seems easy now, right? Okay, guys, now it's time for you to go home, enjoy your well-deserved break, come back refreshed and ready to rock the PSSA. Thank you.